Hey everyone, it's Mark here from the Droid Goblin channel and today I'll be looking at the top 5 material design apps for your phone. So let us begin with today's new video. If you've ever taken photos on your phone or simply stored a lot of images on it, chances are you used a decent gallery app. Sure that stock gallery app that comes with your phone is pretty good, but what if you wanted more? Well welcome to Quick Pick my go-to app I've been using for years and it's just recently received a good splash of material design treatment. So yes, QuickPick is a gallery app, but its user interface and experience is incredibly hard to beat. The first thing you'll notice though is its speed. It's incredibly fast. It's also really easy to use, like the developers actually sat down and thought what users would want and nothing more. Viewing, selecting, deleting and sorting images are all a breeze and with features such as syncing up all your storage cloud accounts and viewing images by events is just icing on the cake. There's even security built into the app to protect those prying eyes. Yes, Quick Pick hasn't left anything out, yet it somehow keeps getting better. I've tried many different apps over the years, but Quick Pick is just so refined. And now with its added material design freshness, the app is on a whole new level. Oh, file explorers, even though apps like these are focused mainly on how easy they are to use rather than their looks, there is one app that has both. Well, almost. Cabinet by Adane Follestad, which is currently still in beta, focuses on a simple user interface with clean material design aspects to help clean things up. And the result is amazing. As mentioned, it's still in beta, so some of the features haven't been included yet, but I'm sure they're on the way. But if you're like me and only need it for the essentials, such as moving files and other general file management, this app is great. I really enjoy the easy sorting option right there at the top and that side drawer which brings up your favorite folders which can be added or removed as desired is pretty neat too. The developer has put in a great deal of effort into its material design elements. They don't detract from the user experience, but rather help the general flow of the app itself. So if you're tired of your current file explorer, I would recommend giving Cabinet a try. I've been using it for a while now and the experience along with its material design appeal has been amazing. I recently did an article of my top 5 music players, but I do think that Phonograph Music Player by Kabu Zaid, previously Gramophone, needs to be added to that list too. It's still currently in beta, however it's perfect for someone wanting a super clean music player that's also one of the most fluid. You can tell straight away that it's been created using material design guidelines from the ground up. Neat transitions are everywhere, as well as bold colors and easy to use features. But it's more than just flashy animations. Phonograph also comes with Last FM support, so your artist info is always top notch, and dynamic colors match the album's bass, so everything looks a little bit more clean and polished. Don't forget that there's still all the standard features, such as creating playlists, queuing songs, and adding a widget if you're into that. You might be thinking, I've already got a material design music player, and it's made by Google. That may be true, but perhaps you're a little tired of the lack of artist images, the inability to customize its design, or maybe just that orange just really isn't your style anymore. Phonograph is great, it's free, and it's super material, so go give it a try today. Like it or not, no matter what launcher you use, Nova Launcher will always seem to be that safe bet. And now with its material design overhaul, that bet has just become a lot safer. It may not be as ingenious as Action Launcher, decorative as Thema, or in-depth as Lightning Launcher, but it's just so good at what a launcher should be, reliable. Now even before its major UI overhaul, Nova was already the number one choice as the best go-to launcher. Its resemblance to the stock launcher meant transitioning was easy, but it's in those extra features, features which make your life easier and never break down, make it truly amazing. Changing your home screen and app drawer layouts, its look and feel, and everything else is just a breeze and now with its new material design feel, it feels as if you're reshaping the Google Now launcher into something of sheer wonder. I've always been a fan of Nova, its gesture support, its unread count support, the way it handles the grid lines and effortless fluidity between screens makes it a sure in if you're thinking of choices for a new launcher. Plus that material design upgrade makes you realize that you might not get a better launcher than this. Lastly, we have the Today Calendar. Competing head to head against the material powered Google Calendar, it sails away to a clear victory, leaving the feature shy Google Calendar in its wake. Today Calendar hits you with its on point functionality and picks you up with its eye pleasing visuals. 
The first thing you'll notice is that glorious split view where you'll get to see the current month as well as today's agenda. Something that Google somehow still struggles to get right, amongst other things. Everything is also a lot more user friendly. Tap that plus icon and you can quickly add in an upcoming appointment with its quick add mode. Advanced options, which if you say you want to add in people or location or make it a recurring event can be added in the edit mode. You also get a flurry of extra features such as the weather, enhanced widgets and the ability to change those material design colors into whatever suits your mood. Today Calendar has virtually everything you've ever wanted in a calendar app. It's quick and to the point for all your agenda and its material design look makes it even easier to navigate and understand the overall app. The pro version unlocks even more features. But in the end, Today Calendar is one of those apps that you need to have on your phone today. So thanks very much guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button as well as to please subscribe to the Droid Goblin channel if you haven't already. What's your favorite material design app? Let me know in the comment section below. But other than that, it's Marco here from the Droid Goblin channel and I'll see you guys next video.